My name is Isaac Nicholson and we're here at the Pool Trade Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. We are Liberty Outer National. We're here to bring fashion forward products to the public, but all sustainable. Liberty is about a futuristic lifestyle movement rather than just fashion. We'd like people to live the same lifestyle that we have enjoyed in the past, but to have less of an impact on the planet as a whole. This brand is really a vehicle for consciousness or information about sustainable lifestyles. So what we're doing, you know, this hat tells an interesting story. For instance, the uh, straw or the grass is uh, fair trade raffia from Africa, and it's woven in a woman's co-op in China. And then the binding is a hemp and an organic cotton uh, binding. So it, every piece tells an amazing story. We call these the Reef Climbers, Procentric Board Short, the Trip Trunk, the Batty Rider Short. These are the conch trunks for spring 2008. It's called the Fori Fedora, named after one of our friends who travels a lot, Forrest Shearer. He's a pro snowboarder. This is our uh, Riptide ripstop material. It's made from hemp and recycled plastic bottles. It's a hemp organic cotton fur. Many defenseless hemps died to create these pelts. This is called H-Bone and it's a blend between hemp and organic cotton. You know, cotton, you plant a whole field of cotton, all you're getting is fiber. You plant a whole field of hemp, you're getting medicine, food, biofuel, and fiber out of it. Right. And paper, and board, and particle board, and all kinds of cool stuff. So it's time for us to start using our heads. You know, we can make it hard on ourselves or we can make it easier on ourselves. This isn't the same kind of peasant clothing that <laughs> hemp used to be made of. <laughs> This is fashionable and functional as well. I'm wearing a 2008 uh, our striped t-shirts, uh, which is hemp and cottons, um, and this is like our foodie. Actually, I'm wearing a woman's cut. <laughs> I didn't even know it. It's basically the original one love symbol. This is a an ancient symbol that predates Christianity from northern Ethiopia, a region called Aksum. This is a symbol that represented all the incarnations of the great spirit that they knew of in that time, all these different branches that come off of it. We call it the culture jammer. The thing at the end of the day, if we can make a change, if we can facilitate or actualize a massive change or a change on a massive level within the industry or the economy, I would go home happy. I know I did my job. Consumers aren't going to be able to make a conscious choice until you provide that choice. You know, so that's what we're here to do. This is definitely one of the only viable functional trends going that's brand new and, and also so critical to the human race. There's never really been a trend that's so important, not just like flash in the pan style that's meant to be out of style next season so you buy the new thing. This is a trend that's more of a, a coming standard. This is a trend that's not going to die out. It's not just a decade-long trend either. This is like the future. You are